people are exploiting the Pokemon Sleep. Pokemon Sleep exploit sees players pretend to rack up weeks of sleep for Pokemon Go rewards. Who could have seen this coming, guys? <laughs> right, right, right. People are going to abuse something. People are going to try to get as much of the reward they're going to try to get uh, for the reward. If the war reward is worth doing this, then the reward is worth doing it. Pokemon Go. Who knew, man? We all knew something. somebody's going to do this. Or some people are going to do this. Come on, we knew this. Before we dive right into this article, we got to hear a few words from our favorite sponsor. You know who they are. You know, do you know who they sound like? They sound so familiar. Every time, every time I see those sponsorships, those sponsor videos, that sponsor part of the video, sounds familiar. I wonder who that person is. Sounds so beautiful. Great voice. I wonder who that is, guys. Let me know, guys. Nobody has ever told me who that is. Nobody has ever told me who that person is. Let's hear that. Let's hear that beautiful voice of that our sponsor. We got to treat our sponsors right. We got to treat our sponsors right. Hi, guys. Arthur, owner of Camelot Shops. The majority of the shops that you see here will be owned by me. So if you're interested in either purchasing coins, raids, passes, or items in the shop, then you can come into the link in the description down below this video. The description. Click click it. Click the link. The link will be my Discord server. And come and join us. You don't have to buy anything that you see here. You can just join us and have some fun. We are also introducing a new shop, the Stardust Farm Shop. If you're interested in collecting more Stardust, you don't want to be collecting mild, uh, collecting bunches and bunches of Pokemon, then you are, you are in luck. We have just opened up a Stardust Farm shop. If you're interested, you can, like I said, go to the link in the description, click the link, my Discord, and you can join us. Also, if it's your first time purchasing, you'll get a promo. Well, you'll get an extra 500 coins on your first purchase no matter what you purchase you'll get an extra 500 coins if you uh, purchase either a membership or a subscription on either to the two platforms uh, called YouTube or Twitch then you'll have that promo for however long you stay a subscriber or a member so either or so if you bought a membership or a subscription and became a subscriber or a member on those on either of those two platforms. You don't have to be both. You can have just one or the other. Just let me know in the Discord and you'll get the extra 500 coins. Come, have some fun and join us on the Discord. I don't have a problem with it, guys. If you want to abuse something, you can abuse it, guys. I don't have a problem with it. It's not a big issue. Um, this article is having a big issue about it, but I don't have a, I don't have a problem. If, if Nerfantic is allowing you to do it, then do it, do it. If Nerfantic is allowing you to do it, do it. Pokemon Sleep, players with access to the games, uh, 50 Euro Pokemon Go plus, plus peripheral are pretending to sleep in order to quickly speed toward Pokemon Go rewards. Pretending. How can you pretend to sleep? Well, you can just lay down, but... Like, how does the machine know if you're actually sleeping or not? Is it watching us? Is, Ner is Nerfantic actually watching us? Is it not just a machine? Is it not just a little device? Is, is, is it not just that? Is it actually motion sex sensor? Is it, mo is it motion sensing us? Or is it actually watching us with a little camera? Ooh, we're going diving into conspiracy theory right here. How does it know that we're sleeping? The new uh, nap, well, it probably has motion sensor maybe for that reason. And if you lay down, maybe it senses as a, well, like, you know what? They're laying down. They're laying down. That means that they're sleeping. 
The new nap tracking app requires you to record at least 90 minutes of sleep per day. And it's this minimum which users are now recording before manually changing the date on their phones to then record another 90 minutes to so forth. So they change the date. <laughs> oh man. This is a hey, it's a glitch right there, man. We we use a hey, if, it, if we can use it, we can use it. <laughs> I would do the same thing. I would do the same thing that these people were doing. If I had the device and I can trick it and say, look, it's the next day because they rely on the time. They don't actually go outside and say, oh, my God, this is not the same day. <laughs> this is the same day that it was the same day. They don't track the actual day. They actually they track the time. So if you change your time, of course, people are going to abuse it. The thing is, if you use that feature and you change the time and date, you try to revert back, you're going to miss all those rewards that you would have gotten throughout those days. That's the thing about that. But um, you can live without that because you're skipping around, skipping around from time to days to dates. So uh, <laughs> I don't mind y'all guys doing this, guys. It's not a big issue to me. Um, is there, if there is a way for a neurophatic to to do something about this, they probably will find a way to stop this from happening. But I don't think it's a big deal, and I don't think they they consider this a big deal. But people are exploiting it, and um, I don't mind them doing it. Play uh, play smarter, not harder, guys. Play that's my analogy for all gaming: is play smarter, not harder. Repeating this method allows you to rack up rewards for recording a week's worth of sleep, albeit no less than 90 minutes at a time. In just a few hours, users writing on Pokemon Fan Reddit, the Silk Road say, and doing so seem fairly straightforward with the app's sleep sensor, simply turned off and on without you actually having to sleep. So you can turn off the sensor <laughs> and then it can still think that you're sleeping if you turn off the center the sensor this is right here but with the apps sleep sensor simply turned off and on without you actually having to sleep <laughs> you can just turn it off and on uh, <laughs> I'll tell you guys if I had this device which I'm not it's a very expensive device I know it's like 60 bucks People will say, well, it's just 60 bucks. Uh, you have 60 bucks laying around just to waste, knowing how, uh, knowing all the videos that you watched of me talking about this device, um, having some er errors and issues, and resetting to factory setting. Come on, man. Why are people doing this? It's all for a special Snorlax in a, in a costume in Pokemon Go. Oh, you get a reward every for every day you do it. Oh, and then you get the the chance to get the shiny one, right? Okay, I think they're trying to go after the shiny. That's why they're probably doing it for to go after the shiny. Connecting Pokemon Sleep to Pokemon Go requires the Pokemon Go Plus Plus gadget, which connects to both apps via Bluetooth and acts as a bridge for your data between the pair. And um, with the, uh, I don't know if for sure right now there's still going on, but there is seems to be a connectivity issue um, with the, especially with the new update. So every time Pokemon Go or Nerfantic update the game, it seems like there's always some bug issues. They try to patch something and then they, for some odd reason, that patch doesn't fix, uh, that patch makes something worse or causes something else to happen. It's like this is supposed to work, make it not do anything else, or and try to fix the problem and not make another problem. And what it does is it does uh, it does the opposite. <laughs> it does the opposite and makes another problem. And that's what that new update did. It caused another problem. When first connected to Pokemon Go Plus, the Plus oh wait wait which connects both. Okay, I already read that. When uh, first connected to Pokemon Go, the Plus Plus will unlock an exclusive qu uh, quest line in the app, which 
requires you to track your sleep data for seven days in order to unlock the exclusive cost costume nightcap Snorlax. And they say it could be shiny. And I'm thinking if they can let, uh, uh, could it be that they're allowing you to do this throughout the whole time you have this device? Players who have rushed ahead have found four further nightcap <laughs> Snorlax are available at the end of successive weeks. The costume creature is only available via the plus plus quest line and as a f and as further draw is available in its ultra rare shiny version. In Pokemon Go, the odds of receiving a shiny of most most wild Pokemon sit at a at a base rate of around 1 in 520. That's okay. So, first of all, I thought it was 1 in 500, not 1 in 520. But I'm glad to know that now we have a. They have increased. I'm glad that we know, but it's bad that they now have increased the odds of a shiny in the wild. Although it's unclear what Nightcap Snorlax chances are. As of yet, I have not seen anyone claim to have won online. Of course, doing all of the, this negates the whole point of Pokemon Sleep, which is to encourage you to get a healthy night's slumber, which won't work for me because um, I don't sleep that much, guys. I sleep around three to four hours a day. I, I need to be up for, for at least 20 hours. So that I can be available for you for 20 hours. I can't give you 24 hours. I can't stay open for 24 hours. I'll be dead if I do that. I need my sleep. But um, I stay three or four hours, maybe five. Ready to give you 19. Sometimes I give you 19. Sometimes, sometimes I give you 20. But um, this game, this little uh, thing, Pokemon Sleep, will not be good for me because I don't stay that sleep that much. <clears throat> It's worth remembering that the re recommended daily amount of sleep is seven hours, which I don't take seven hours. I take, like I said, three to four hours, which I usually want to take four hours. So I sleep like late into the night, like around, I want to sleep around like a, like, like around 11 a.m. my time, 11 p.m. my time. Maybe I'll take some naps here and there. They're like, like 20 to maybe 25 minutes naps, but that's it. And that, uh, that, uh, and that those costume Snorlax will still be waiting for you in a few weeks time. <laughs> in a few weeks time. I wonder if you can do it for those researches that you need like to spin a Pokestop every day. I wonder if you can do that. I wonder if you, has it, I don't, I think people have tried it though, right? People have tried to do that thing and <laughs> it didn't work. It, it worked. Like a long time ago, like three or four years ago, when they had those raid days for like Articunos, Moltres, Zapados, and the Legendary Beast, they didn't have it after those th uh, those two generations, the three, the trios, those first two trios of Gen 1 and Gen 2, they didn't have it anymore, but they did allow you to switch the time, and they track, that's how they track the time. The thing is, People were abusing it and exploiting it <laughs> while so they can get elite because they will give you five free raid passes. This they did it in Pokemon Go. They they'll give you five free raid passes. So it's each different time zone you'll get that those fifteen raid passes because you'll get you'll get those you, you get the one that like you do at night the five and then you switch it around. You don't get their their shiny at that and that first five then you'd go. Uh, switch your time and make it into a different country time and you get another five free raid passes and then again you switch it again to the exact time and uh, or you can just wait because I think you wait and then you still get your five free I don't remember it's been a long time since they allowed you to do that but uh, they uh, Nerfantic figured it out and they were seeing people were abusing that type of system and uh, did something about it. <laughs> and they stopped that from happening. Just like uh, just like they added a 
two hour limit from one place to another from spoofing they did that to the time they 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 fixed it so that people won't abuse that power or exploit that power or exploit that not power but exploit it exploit that um little feature that people could do so the game was way much more funner and more lax and free-flowing in the first three years after that after the first three years or after the three first four years we uh after those first four years then they started implementing more uh rules and rules and rules into the game so Blame us for, uh, blame those first four years, blame us for doing that and causing that situation to happen. But that's it for this video, guys. Make sure to smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, ring the bell for notifications, share the video, put your thoughts in the comment section. Don't forget what our famous and most important and beloved sponsor said in the early part of the video. The link will be in the description. That's where you will find me and everybody else that has joined so far. Hope you have a great day. Hope that you found this not more informative, but maybe if you do have the device, maybe you do want to maybe take a part in exploiting that little feature right there, that little exploitation type of way. If you want to get to those Snorlaxes, like I, I don't mind you doing it. If you if it's there, do it, right? If they If it's not broken, if, it, if they don't fix it, keep using it. They're, and I don't think they're going to fix it because it's, it's not that big of a deal. To me, it's not that big of a deal. But maybe for you, but to me, it's not a big deal. It's, just, it's the same thing. That I compare this to the same thing that I just mentioned a few seconds ago about the switching of times when it come, came to the raids. When it came to raids, when, we, when they did those raid days, we switched the times. We got 15 free raid passes and it's because of the second time that we did it after those go fest after the go fest after this third go fest and after those legendary beasts were coming out every, uh, for every month i think it was every month or every week I, I could be wrong but i would think it was probably every month or every week i think probably it was every week either one it's like far way back man guys I don't, I'm not going to remember every single thing about what's been going on when I played this game. But yeah, this reminds me of that. <laughs> so that's why I brought up that story. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Hope you uh, enjoyed it. Hope you found this maybe informative to help you. Maybe you want to maybe exploit this little situation right here. So thank you, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Peace out.